Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Friday and I figured I would do just a little bit of a vlog. So I am currently sitting here with Elliot. It's about 10.30 in the morning and I went to the DMV bright and early. There has been so many issues with either getting my license or just like the whole process of that. There's been so many issues so I had to go back in today and we got part of it fixed and I have to go back next week on the Tuesday to get the rest of it completed. So I am now back at home with Miss Elliot. I was going to do a changing video with her but she just looks so darn cute in this little outfit. It's got little um, like corally colored flowers so I decided to pair it with that onesie and she just looks super cute. So I think I'm going to leave her in this. And, I don't know, maybe go through some of the baby things, organize it, stuff like that. We are going to lunch in about 45 minutes with my mom when she gets off for her lunch break. And then we are going to come back home and just hang out. Um, I am really hoping to, I don't know, re, not reorganize per se, but set up the baby items a little bit better in my closet because it's really hard to get to things. I find that when I want to change one of the girls, all of the girls clothes are on the very bottom bin and I have to move everything out and it's just really heavy to try to lift everything. So I'm going to hopefully try to find a little bit better solution to how I can set that up. So I figured I would just kind of bring you guys along with me, um, you know, and how I set things up and just kind of hang with me for the afternoon. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's go ahead and get started. So this is my closet at the moment. I have my like sock and underwear drawers down there and I decided to keep this changing table. I thought it was a good place to store some of the babies, which it obviously has been. And then I have that bin, which is all of the other babies that are for sale. The boys bin, the car seat, obviously, um, Paxton and uh, Lakin are sitting there. But then if you come back in here, I've got this shelf that has some of the blankets on it, which I'm thinking I'm going to move it down to the very bottom. And then I have the girls bin and then just another bin with random stuff in it and then up there I've got the bin with all of like the pacifiers and the accessories the extra diapers and then all of the other accessories over here so everything is kind of I don't know it's not really working for me at the moment so I'm going to try to find a place where I can keep all of these bins but they're still easy to get to so I'm probably going to be rearranging this a little bit but at least you guys got to kind of see what it looked like beforehand I don't have too too much time before we leave to go have lunch but I'm going to try to start taking things out and reorganizing it so it's a little bit better um, and just so that the flow works Okay guys, so it is about 1 o'clock now. We went and had some lunch with my mom, ran a few errands, and now we are back at home. I have the worst like cramp right underneath like my rib cage almost, and it hurts so bad. So I decided to lay down on my bed and try to, I don't know, just lay flat and relax and hopefully it will go away, but it's not. So I wanted to sit down. Um, I'm still trying to plan out exactly how I want the closet slash nursery area to be. I just, I don't know. I feel like, I feel like I want the nursery to be in there so that the babies are close and I can get them out whenever, but at the same time, I just don't know how I can set it up where it's going to be, like, easily accessible and I don't know yet. So, if you guys have any, like, tips, I guess, on... If you have your nurseries in a closet or something, let me know like how you guys kind of set it up because I'm trying to like maximize the space I have. I have a lot of storage space on like the top because there's lots of shelves, but I just don't know what I'm going to do at the bottom. So if you guys have any ideas, let me know. But yeah, so I wanted to sit down though really fast and talk to you guys about the babies I have for sale. 
So I do have um, my older collection, if you will, for sale. And then I did post about any of these babies in here um, having feelers out for them. So I've gotten a lot of interest in Hunter, as you guys may know, or Paxton right here. And he's kind of a forever baby at the moment. I don't know if I'm going to be selling him right now. Um, but I do, I don't know, like, do you guys ever deal with this? I feel like I'm so attached to them because obviously, like, I got them and, you know, I really enjoy them and I like them. But when I look at them all together, I'm just like, this is not my ideal collection, but I feel sad when I sell one of them. So, I don't know. I want to sell them because I do want to get, you know, another baby that would be my ideal collection. So, I am putting feelers out for all of them. Um, I'm just curious to see who would be interested in the babies and whatnot. So, if any of you guys are interested um, in, like, my personal collection, we've got Hunter or Paxton, Ben, Marley, Drew, Elliot, Sophia, Jacob, and then um, Lakin. Which, Lakin, I have had her up for sale before, and she still is for sale, so she is definitely one that would be for sale. Um, Jacob, I am considering. Marley, I am considering. And Ben, I am considering. So... Um, if you guys are interested, I guess just let me know in the comments. But anyway, um, I'm going to, I don't know, I guess just kind of play around and see how I can rearrange the closet, you know. So I'm going to do that and I will check back in with you guys once I have something created. Okay, so this is what I currently have set up. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with that yet, but... I did move my tall dresser to this side. Um, it works because my door is still able to be, well, more than straight open. Um, and then I have my little jewelry things hanging there for the time being, which honestly isn't too bad because they just hook right underneath to the little wires and it works there, you know, obviously gets displayed. But yeah, so that's where my dresser is. I moved my little shoe stand right there, and then I still have all of my, like, dress, like my fancy dresses, like prom dresses and stuff are still over there. Don't know what I'm going to do with those at the moment, but yeah, so that definitely opened up that area in right here. I still need to figure out what I'm going to do with this, but um, yeah, so I'm just going to kind of keep moving around and kind of playing with it and see if I like it, so I will show you guys the final product really soon. Okay guys, so it is now like 4.30. I ended up laying down and I watched a movie, but I also did a few things in here. So this is now what it looks like. I'm loving this setup. So right here I have both of the boys' bins and then the girls' bins. And then I decided to put this back over here. I just thought it kind of matched better because these are the same kind of shelves. So I just have my little like candle and just like little decorative pieces and then three shoes. And then I decided to put the changing table on top of these shelves. I just thought they looked a lot nicer and the fact that I have the baby things down below, I just like the look of it. So I've got those four up there for the time being. And then in this shelf, I just have some of the lighter like receiving blankets and muslin swaddles, stuff like that. Down here I have all of the like car seat canopy covers and anything that matches it. And then down there I have some of the thicker blankets. And then this is what I did. Oh, it looks so cute. So if you guys remember, I used to have these bins um, and I used to categorize them. So I decided to put little tags on them. So now I know exactly what it is. Obviously I would know anyways, but I just think it looks cuter. So we have the hair bows and mittens, the hats, the socks, bibs, and then other. And then right here I just have the diaper bag and then the boppy pillow. So up here is pretty much the same as far as like the left side up there, but I did put the other little baby um, bin there. It's still stuff I need to like look through and decide if I want to keep it, but it's right there for right now. And then the diapers are right there. And obviously you guys saw this part earlier, 
but I did put this shelving back here. Um, I just thought it looked a little bit better and that way all my stuff's to one side and all the baby stuff's to the other side. I still need to find a spot to um, hook that up underneath. But yeah, so that is what it looks like for right now. I also have these little, I don't know what they're called, but they're like little wire lights. I used to have them, but I didn't know where to put them. And it fits in there perfect to hold it. So I'm going to turn this light off. I'm going to turn these on. And I'm going to come in here and hopefully you guys can see the effect. It is the coolest thing ever. So there's the babies. I know it's kind of hard to see. But look at that. It's the cutest little light. It's just enough. But look at the pattern. It's so much prettier in person, but it's so cool. And this is only one string of those lights. I have another string, which I'll probably add on. But it's so cute because it's kind of like quiet and relaxing in here. And obviously, you know, it's just enough light for the baby. So, oh, super, super cute. Oh, I love it. But anyways, so that's just what I wanted to show you guys so far of what I've gotten done. I'm still, oh, I still have a lot to kind of go through. So I've got this bin, which has all of the babies that are for sale and their items. This box, which has all of my like old decoration stuff. I really don't know what to do with that. I haven't even looked unless it's in that box. The clothes bin, um, like our dirty hamper and stuff that I need to go put in the laundry room. And then I have the car seat, which I need to find a place for, as well as for Sophia. The trash basket right there. Um, I've got two of the babies on the bed. This bag is stuff to go to the consignment shop. Um, obviously the bed looks all messy and I just have a whole bunch of stuff just laying out. So I'm going to get this cleaned up so it at least looks a bit more organized and I will see you guys in just a little while. Well guys, this is what I came up with. Um, it's like super hot upstairs and I'm like dying of heat. So I just put everything back in here for now. I still need to find the right place for that trash can. I'm not a huge fan of the car seat there, only because that means I'm going to have to move that every single time I want to get into the bins. And I just put them down there for now. But that is what it looks like. Um, I got this all picked up and I um, folded like three loads of clothes. <laughs> so for right now, that's just going to sit there. Um, that's the bin that has all of the babies for sale. And I just don't know where to put it for right now, so it's just going to sit there for the time being. But, yeah, I have a fan going because it's really hot and it's not helping whatsoever. So, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It's kind of an odd style vlog because I didn't really go out or do too much. But I hope you guys enjoyed seeing it anyways, and we'll talk to you in our next video.